One of the first things we noticed that may not be too obvious actually, but it is, is the fact that batteries in a solar application sit stationary for a long periods of time. Whereas our other products that we built over the years are usually in equipment that get moved around. That causes a big difference internally inside the battery. Now during that normal charging process, we want to overcharge the battery to prevent stratification. Stratification occurs when the electrolyte is stronger at the bottom than at the top of the battery. We want to prevent that. Also what happens in that deep, deep cycle process is material sheds off the positive plate naturally and settles at the mud well at the bottom of the battery. What can happen though during that overcharging is those particles get circulated in the electrolyte during the charging and they can settle on top of the battery. Once they settle on top of the cells inside the battery, they can come together and actually reactivate, cause a short, and cause premature failure. Another thing we've noticed in the solar battery application is grid corrosion of the positive plates. It happens over long-term float charging, which means the battery is kept on full charge for a long period of time. And then when it's deeply discharged and the heavy charging occurs to recharge the battery, there is a tendency for that long-term sitting to cause grid corrosion prematurely. The Defender Moss Shield was born out of the need to prevent corrosion on top of the battery. During the charging process, we want to always overcharge the battery a certain amount in order to circulate the electrolyte in the battery. Also, we've noticed that in solar applications, these batteries sit for a long time and they actually sit on what we call float charge, which means they're ready to be used. What that causes over time is that material can actually collect on top of the cells themselves and actually short circuit and cause premature failure. The Defender Moss Shield sits on top of the cells and keeps that material away from the top of the plates themselves and it's tremendous insurance purchase for the future. Now, OSP, the outside positive plate, simply means we've added an extra positive plate to the end of the packs inside the battery. We've learned over time that solar batteries sit for a long period of time and they're subject to premature grid corrosion on the positive plates. These outside positive plates actually increase the ratio of positive to negative and reduce that chance for grid corrosion over a long period of time. Now the thicker fiberglass backing material is actually inside the cells between the plates. What we want to make sure is that during these long periods of time when the battery sits, that the acid is readily available to the surface contact surfaces of the plates so that when the chemical process takes place, there's acid there. This extra fiberglass backing helps maintain that presence of electrolyte over a long period of time. Now, I also want to mention that U.S. battery with almost all of our batteries, the terminals are hand welded and much tougher. Also, we've got this tough case. We've got, got heavy duty ropes. But now there's another couple of things that I want you to know about all of our flooded lead acid batteries that apply to these, and that is XC2. It's a synthetic material that's in the positive plate of the battery that uh, does many, many things that a chemist could explain, but to put it to you simply, it simply makes the plate stronger. It gives the battery itself a higher initial quality when it comes out of the box. It's got more reserve capacity when it's brand new. It reaches peak capacity sooner. It stays up there longer, gives you longer life over the cycle, life of the battery, and it gives just an overall longer performance. If you picture it in a bell curve, it comes up sooner, stays up there longer, and lasts longer. You get more cycle life and long period of time. And I might mention that the, in the RE series, we're so confident in this chemistry that we've changed that we have a seven year limited warranty for this product. Again, on behalf of US Battery, Thanks for watching and we hope that you will visit our website at www.usbattery.com.